Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Matt and Nat Travel That. Now, I have a surprise for Natalie, and we're going to be staying in this. It's a wine barrel cabin. Shh. <laughs> Keep the secret, all right? Because I wanted to do something special for her, and this is my way of showing her how much I appreciate her. So you guys are more than welcome to come and check this video out and come along for the adventure. We're going to be doing a whole bunch of other things as well. So stick around because it's going to be a really cool video. All right. Oh, I'm so excited for this. Yes. We're off and packed and saying goodbye to Kiki because unfortunately where we're going we can't take any pets with us. Sorry Kiki. Say bye. Say bye. So she's not gonna be following us um, for the rest of the vlog. So say say your goodbyes guys. So we're at Wither Hills Winery. This is their cellar door and we're gonna be doing some tastings. And over there they've got some looks like wine vats. Tanks. Tanks. Actually, wine tanks, so oh, are they? we'll go try some of their wine. <laughs> Let's go. I got tons of soul on my true collective ball. Famous or so famous number one desirable. I do what I want when I want and how I want it. Leave you with the one in the air. Oh, it's not too oaky, okay. it's nine months in barrel, but the barrel's two years old. Mm. I want to say that, you can actually taste the oak, yeah. They can bring me down, na na secret destination that Natalie has no idea about. Do you have any ideas? Nope, no, nope. just the driver. And so, I'm going so, now. Okay, so there's a road called, see Tara been up here. Brookby there's Road. Brookby Road. Yeah. So we want to head on to that. It's my brakes make up. <laughs> so now we're arrived at our destination. I think Natalie saw the sign. Yes, I did. I wondered if this is where his uh, surprise would take us. So you had a feeling? I did, yes. Damn it. Welcome to our barrel. So come on inside to our uh, wine barrel. 
So as you can see, this is our living area. It's actually, even though it's compact, it's really cool. You've got a little couch area here, an umbrella if it's raining to go to the bathroom. Um, we've got water. You see here we've got our hashtag, sleeping in a barrel. So um, definitely look that up. We've got a TV, so you've got free view and everything, so you can watch some TV, tea and coffee, um, all plates and everything that you may need, some wine glasses which will come in handy, um, as well as containers for landfill, compost and recycling, which is really cool. Area, and this is our bar, our bedroom. So sorry, Matt jumped on the bed, so he's already messed it up. Um, so you've got a really cool bed, um, which comes with an electric blanket, which is cool on these cold Marlborough nights. There's awesome light for hanging some clothes if you need to, a heater and a fan, so if it's hot or cold. Really cool window you can open up here and have a look out. So we've got a little, I'm assuming it's probably a fruit tree or something in the back there. Better? Come with me. So, maybe not for winter, but for you summer people, if you're ever staying here, you've got a really cool outdoor setting. A little tap here so you can just wash some dishes or wash your hands and then. An outdoor shower. Woo! Which is pretty cool. On those hot days, it'd be nice to jump in there, have a little bit of a, a cool off, but um, not today. It's a little bit cold. But yeah, really cool venue, awesome roof to keep the heat in. Gonna love it. So, first impressions of our sleeping in a barrel. That's really cool. It's something different, um, better than just staying in a normal boring motel. So, yeah, it's, it's really cool. And now we're off to dinner, but Natalie also doesn't know where we're going. <laughs> Yay. I'm the master of surprises. Mm. <laughs> so, I've surprised Natalie, but she figured it out too soon. <laughs> We are eating at Harvest Restaurant here in Marlborough and it is absolutely beautiful. So our waitress for the night has just given us a complimentary ceviche from the chef. So probably the fanciest place we've ever eaten at and it's so deliciously smelling. The place is amazing. The decor, everything about it just screams French. Show and tell. Uh, I've got the um, ribeye beef with glazed carrots and shallots. And, oh, sorry, there we go. Oh, no, there. I have the wild venison strips, loin strips. And I can't remember what else is on here, but. Uh, I can't remember. It was, it was like ch 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 Oh, yeah, that sounds and good. And I have a Syrah to drink for tonight. And. So the wine is um, Blank Canvas um, Gimlet Gravels 2017 Syrah. So, um, really amazing wine. Cheers. What can I taste from that? Drink specials! I get a little bit of a salty taste actually from it. We just finished our meal at Harvest Restaurant. Bruh, again, the fanciest place I've ever eaten at. How about you? It was amazing. Beautiful ambiance. Um, Samantha, our um, hostess, waitress. Yep. Um, was superb. Um, food, drinks, everything was. could not be faulted. So. Uh, 10 out of 10. If you were in Marlborough, save up a bit of cash, come here. It's well worth it. Absolutely. I'm going to come back here again. Yeah. Yep. And this time. Maybe stay the night. Maybe, Maybe stay the night. They've actually got Marlborough Lodge here as well. I'll provide those links um, somewhere. Just about to head off to bed tonight. <sighs> Every time I mention that word, you just want to yawn. I do. <laughs> anyway, for now, good night. Night.
Good morning. Oh, lovely night sleeping in this barrel. But now it's time to get up and go on more adventures. Are you coming along? I hope so. Come on. One part of us being influencers now is getting up really early in the mornings from wherever we're staying to catch the sunrise, which we kind of sort of did this morning. And also we're just wandering around taking photos. Where, where has she gone? <laughs> I need to stop moping. Ta taking photos and videos <clears throat> of our pretty little surrounding down at the creek again. You what? I like investigating, so I was looking to see what was around, that's all. <laughs> talking to no one. <laughs> There's no camera, talking to lots of people. <laughs> and now it's time for us to say goodbye to our barrel cabin. Goodbye barrel cabin. Bye, barrel. Goodbye. It definitely is, um... Not what I expected, um, totally um, a glamping experience. So if you're into that, if you like camping, but you want a bit more... Luxury? Yeah, definitely check out uh, the hashtag Marlboro is... Marlborough Wine Barrel Cabins. Sorry, Marlborough Wine Barrel Cabins. The hashtag is hashtag sleeping in a barrel. So um, we'll have all the uh, information linked below for you. Natalie has an obsession with moo moos. Hey buddy! <laughs> You're very cute! Is that his name? Moo moo? Yep. Moo moo. Yeah, I've named him moo moo. Oh, I've got moo moos on the side looking, they're not as cute though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if I would have answered me, that would have been Not really interested. Cool. No, he's looking at me though. He's like, why don't you just move on? <laughs> Number one desirable Out of what I want, when I want, and how I want it Leave you with the 